And I remember standing right outside the clinic and my jaw had just dropped. Murder was happening across the street and I literally could do nothing about it. I wanted to be able to say to my kids, like I took a stand for something that mattered. Even when we had talks in chapel, it, it hit me so hard because we watched videos and documentaries and stuff. And I just, I couldn't understand that people were so oblivious to the fact that this was going on. Because personally me, I was in eighth grade when we started talking about this. And I don't know how I didn't know it was going on. And I knew that I had to do something about it. A male had come out and he had, his girl was in the clinic and she was scheduled to have an abortion. And he had come over and we were just leaving. And I saw him come out because I had spoke to him previously. And we had a 30 minute to 45 minute conversation and the number one thing he brought up was, what if there's complications? What if the woman's life is in danger and not the baby? And then I brought up the story of my birth. The doctors had told her that the baby will be fine, but you will die if you give birth to her. And so they said abortion would be the safest bet right now. And my parents said abortion is not even a question. And so my mom almost died having me. And I knew that she had fought for me and the Lord had fought for me harder than anyone. And I knew that my life has so much value if someone was willing to fight for me. And so that's one of the main reasons why I stand out here. One of the main things that we do give out is the gift bags. And in a, inside the gift bag has a handwritten note from the counselors. And it's saying, we're here for you, we love you. And also inside is um, information about life, like the stages of life at like week 12, like the heartbeat and everything. And then we also give them baby socks mm -hmm. so that you can, that they'll see that there it is a child and that this is the size that their feet will be when they're born. And so it's just like a realization to them that they do have a baby inside of them. I personally put myself in their position and say, if I was that girl going in there, what would I want to hear that would hit home? And we used to have a line of sidewalk counselors and we'd say, your baby's going to be beautiful. Like, what if the baby has your eyes or your smile? Like, wouldn't you love to see that? And so it's really just putting yourself in their position. And also you have to realize that if you were that child in there, wouldn't you want someone to stand up and fight for you and say that your life has meaning? One of the girls who had come out of the clinic said to me, if you guys were here last time I got an abortion, then I wouldn't even have thought twice about it because nobody gave her other options. And so it's really all about giving them options and telling them that it is a child. It's not just a group of cells and that it's a gift. Ultimately, it's a gift from God. Great. Thank you.